Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to get a lobby bot, which will let you get every skin, including the unreleased foundation skin, which is actually a secret skin for this battle pass. And you'll be able to get every single skin in the entire game with this lobby bot. So the first thing you want to do is you want to head on over to epicgames.com and you want to create an alt account, like a second account, if you've not already created one. And to do this, you're going to go up here to the sign in button. And then once you're over here, you want to click on sign up and then click on sign up with email. And now you just want to create yourself an account. It, and then once you have, so once you create your second Fortnite account, it should log in up here and it should say the username of your second account. And this is the account that we're using to make our lobby bot today. And this is the account we're using to make our lobby bot. And you can see the mine's called a tonk bot video too. And now the next thing you want to do is you want to go in the description of this video and you want to click on the join link for our discord server. So you want to join the discord server and then once you're in the discord server you just want to scroll down and head on into this channel called create atomic. And once you're on this channel you will see this message over here and it'll say type a exclamation point start to get an atomic bot. So what you want to do is just type a exclamation point start. And now you just want to wait and it should send you a message in about five seconds and you can see it just sent me a message so just click on that message and then once you get into here it will have a control panel and it'll have two links so the first thing you want to do is you want to make sure that you click on this link and that you're logged in with your epic games account at epicgames.com and once you verified that by looking at the top right they are logged into an alt account and not your main account then you are good to go with the next step. So make sure again, this is not your, like your main account, make sure it's that second account that we created at the beginning of the video. So once you have verified that, now what you wanna do is click on the second link right here. And then once you've done that, it should take you to this page. And now what you wanna do is just highlight the entire website. And again, you can do this on your phone or on any device and then just copy it. And then you wanna go back into the Discord and you wanna just paste it into here. And then once you paste it, it should create your lobby bot for you. So you can see that it's created my lobby bot and it'll have the username up here. So the next thing that you wanna do is you wanna go on to your console, your PC, your Switch. This work on any device that can run Fortnite. And you wanna go over to that device. And then you wanna of course just launch up Fortnite and head on over to the lobby. And now once you're in the lobby, what you wanna do is head on into your friend requests. And you wanna head on over here to the add a friend right here and then you want to type in the name of your bot so you can see that the name of my bot is going to be atomic bot underscore video 2 so if you're on pc you can just copy and paste this if you're on a console you can just type it in or on a phone you can also just type it in so just do this and type it in and then it should pop up with this in the search results and just add it and once you've sent out the friend request, you wanna head on back to the Discord and it should have a pop-up asking if you'd like to accept the friend request. So you just wanna click on check if that is your name. And once you've accepted it, it will accept the friend request. So you can see it just accepted my friend request and now you can head on into your player menu and you can invite it to your party. Just like this. And then once you send out the invite to your party, you want to go back into the Discord a second time and you want to just click on the check mark, which means that it has accepted the invite. And once you click on the check mark, it'll accept the invite and it'll join your party. So now that's in your party, you can do all the commands that you want with it and you can do whatever you want pretty much and change all the skins. So now if you want only the bot to be visible in the party, what you want to do is click on manage and make it the party leader. And once it, you have made it the party leader, you want to head back into here and you want to type A exclamation point hide. And then once you've done that, it will hide your player and all the other players in your lobby and it will only show this bot. So now it'll look like you are only using this bot and this is your like actual account. And you can use this for TikToks, YouTube videos, or anything like that. So now what you want to do is to change the skins, what you want to do is you're going to type in A exclamation point skin. And then you can change this to any skin that you want. So let's say that you wanted to get from the battle pass, you wanted to get the unreleased foundation skin. What you want to do is head on over here and you want to type in the foundation. 
So since the season just started on the Atomic Bot, the skin feature is not going to work for all the Chapter 3 skins. If you want to change your Lobby Bot skin to a Chapter 3 skin such as the Foundation or Spider-Man, what you want to do is head back into the server and then you want to click go down to Atomic Help in the Lobby Bot's Help section and then you want to click on this button right here. And then this will take you into this spreadsheet which will have all the IDs for the skins. So if you want to find something like the Spider-Man skin, you just type in Spider-Man in the Control F or Find menu, and then it'll take you down here to the Spider-Man skin, and then you can just copy this ID, and then when you want to change the skin, you want to do A skin, and then just paste in the ID right there, and then you'll be able to change your skin to the Spider-Man skin. And this is only going to be happening for the next few days, so once the skins have been updated, which should happen within a week, then you'll be able to just type in A exclamation point skin and then just type Spider-Man like you normally would on a Lollibot. But as of right now, that is not working. So as you guys can see, it changed my skin to Spider-Man skin. And then if you want to get rid of this back bling, just do A exclamation point backpack, none or clear, and that'll take out the backpack and you'll just have Spider-Man right there. So there's a lot of different commands that you can do and I'm just going to be showcasing a few of them that most people use but you can feel free to read all of these in the help page and all of these commands you can use. So if you want to change the backpack what you want to do is of course do a exclamation point backpack and then type in something like ghost portal and that'll change the backpack. And then if you want to change the level do a exclamation point level and then change something like 10. And there you go, the level has been changed to 10. And then if you want to change out the emote, you just do A exclamation point emote, and then you can do something like floss. And that'll change it to the floss emote. And now if you want to get something unreleased, like the foundation skin, as you can see in the battle pass, it is unreleased as of right now. If you want to get that skin, what you want to do is you want to go back to that Google Sheets and you want to just search for the foundation. And then what you want to do is you want to look for the right one. There's going to be two of them. You want to make sure it's the one with the picture and the one that's not unreleased. And you want to just copy this and then do A exclamation point skin and then paste it in. And you'll get the foundation skin. And as you can see right here, we have the unreleased foundation skin in our lobby with the lobby bot. So that's how you get the unreleased foundation skin and all the other unreleased skins. And if you want to use the normal search feature on the Lollibot to get a normal skin without having to do this ID thing, you can get any skin before chapter 3 by just doing a simple A exclamation point skin and then just typing in something like Renegade Raider. And then you'll be able to have the Renegade Raider in your lobby. As you can see right here, we got the Renegade Raider and you can show that off to your friends and just troll people with that since it is an OG skin. So yeah, that's the end of the video, and thank you guys for watching. Again, you can use all of these skins and all of these commands over here if you want to, and you can test them all out. There's a lot of cool commands that you can use that are really useful, and you can also use all of the normal commands like A skin Spider-Man in the next coming days when the search feature gets updated. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.